Tax refunds are starting to roll in for many people. Now, if yours wasn't exactly what you were hoping for, you might need to change your withholding. Troy Sutton explains in this week's KTAB Financial Friday. Growing up, my parents taught me that complaining was a worthless and frustrating endeavor that merely made it rain on everybody else's parade. Ever hear the axiom, if you don't have anything nice to say, shut your pizza hole? Well, that was the motto in my family. At least for a while, anyway. Then I joined the Army. <laughs> I learned in the Army that complaining is part of the job description. It's an art. So long as the commanding officer wasn't around or your NCO, it was open season on complaining with your battle buddies. We complained about the food we had to eat or, or weren't allowed to eat, the jobs we had to do or wish we could do, the weather always, the showers or lack thereof, politics, there was no end to the creativity of our complaints. After a day or two of eating MREs, on one deployment, one soldier says, thanks for dinner, Sergeant. You're welcome, Private. What did you get? I got sick, but it was worth it. I was reminded of that experience recently due to the number of complaints I heard from clients and friends about their tax refunds this year. Hmm. My refund has never been smaller. I owed for the first time in years. I thought we were supposed to have fewer taxes thanks to Trump. Any of that sounding a little bit familiar? The average tax refund as of April of this last month was 2725 for 2019. When compared with last year, that was down from 2780 or a whopping $55 or 2%. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. We're breaking the bank. Furthermore, nearly 18% of Americans, according to Fox News, owed additional money to cover their 2018 tax bill. That's about one in five. Well, howdy do, that's not awesome. Let the creative complaining begin. The Army taught me another thing, that such complaining bonded soldiers together, creating camaraderie through a shared experience. So, you and I, We've now bonded, now that we've complained about taxes. However, what is the cause? The IRS and Treasury Department sought many times during 2018 to remind Americans that a change in taxes requires adjustments on tax withholdings from your paycheck. They frequently and repeatedly urged workers in America to adjust their withholding amounts on their W-4s last year. So I ask, did you? If you didn't, that contributed to the change in your refund. Oh, and by the way, a tax refund is not a bonus check or a gift from the IRS that we receive at our birthday party and either rejoice at the toy we wanted or sulk if it was a pair of socks. The tax refund is merely money that you gave the IRS that you didn't owe based on your tax obligations. So. Maybe if your tax obligations are smaller, your refund is probably smaller too. Remember, the new tax law saw about 80% of filers receiving a net tax benefit. However, you could just as easily have seen that benefit in the form of a higher paycheck per month rather than a larger refund check. The IRS is also going to release a new, get this, new dun, 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 W-4 form in time for next year's filing, which is supposed to be more detailed than the current W-4. The agency is crossing their fingers to get a more accurate bead on what should be withheld from people's paychecks. If there's one thing that the agency has lots of experience in, it's creating forms. So take a minute, look at your paycheck, Contact your accountant, your financial advisor, the business office at work, and get your tax withholdings for 2019 correct. We're not even halfway through the year, so there's plenty of time to make things right. This whole experience reminds me of the complaint I read about to Domino's Pizza through their chat line that went something like this. Yo, I ordered a pizza that came with no toppings on it or anything. It's just bread. We're sorry to hear about this. Please let our friends at your local Domino's know of this so they can help. Whoa, never mind. I open the pizza upside down. Have a great week. <laughs> Thanks, Troy. Now, if you'd like more advice, you can contact Sutton Financial Group.
They're located at 2449 South Willis in Suite 106. You can also call them at 437-0709 or you can go to suttonfinancialgroup.com.